Hi, it's Carly McAvoy. I wanted to show you how to do scientific notation on your TI-36X Pro calculator. So whenever I'm hitting enter, that's the button at the very bottom, so you won't see that. And when I'm hitting the negative sign, I'm using this, never the subtraction sign for negative. And then um, for scientific notation, we're going to use the EE -E button. You can see it right here, and that is going to be what we enter to get it into the scientific notation mode in a calculator. So for 2.1 times 10 to the third times 4.5 times 10 to the negative 17th, I would enter 2.1 and then the EE -E button and then three because that's the power for this particular number. And then I'm gonna hit times and 4.5 E and then negative 17. So notice that when I put it into the calculator, it doesn't look like this. It looks like this. And this looks like 4.5e negative 17. That's how it looks in the calculator, but the calculator is reading it as we know our problem. Hit enter, and it's going to give you your answer in that same calculator format, which is 9.45e negative 14. So then you would rewrite that as 9.45 times 10 to the negative 14th power, and that would be your answer. Okay, in this one right here where we have a division, you have a couple of choices. You could just type this number in, then hit divided by, and then type that one in, and that will work. You could also use your fraction button, since we know we're working with a fraction here from the beginning. Hit that fraction bar, and on top, 1.84e, and it's the EE -E button, and then negative 18, and then use your arrow key down, and 6.21 EE, and then negative 4, and then hit enter. Now this one we have a really long answer. We're going to round it to the same number of significant digits we had in our problem. So I'll have 2.96 E to the negative 15, or E negative 15, which means, as we know, 2.96 times 10 to the negative 15th power. That's a really easy way to use that. You could do the same thing as one of these calculations using this 10th power, 10e power. You can do that as well. So if I had the first problem, if I did 2.1 and then I'd hit this button twice, that is the button where you have e to the power and then 10 to the power, hit that twice to get to the 10 and then say third power. Then I could enter out of that, say times, and then 4.5 hit that twice to the 10th power negative 17. Some people prefer that because it kind of looks a little bit more like what they see on their paper. Then just hit enter and you're going to get that same answer, um, 9.45e negative 14. All right, that's it. Have a fantastic day.